Hey everyone, how's it going? Andrew Summers here, coming at you with the first description video of the new year. And I have brought with me an unmanned ground vehicle. Now I call this unmanned ground vehicle the Z-01 UGV, to sort of fit military parlance. And this one is meant for my Chinese forces. Now it's actually based off of the Russian Typhoon M. Uh, it's an unmanned ground vehicle intended for security roles. And it sort of has the same design. It's got like a raised back end to it, flat front. It's basically like a box on tracks with a smaller box on the back and a machine gun up top. Now, some of the details, mind you, there aren't too many on this given the size of it. But uh, the first detail I can go over is the tracks themselves. Now, these are Brickmania one by one track links, and they actually move. Not too well, but they move. Don't expect to be rolling this around on any very smooth surface, or I think even like a hard surface like carpet, which is actually a soft surface, I should say. But uh, they don't have much grip, so they're not going to be moving all around the place. But they do move, and then the little wheel details are just made of studs right there. Otherwise, on the model, the front end, you have a little bumper bar here, in case you decide you want to smack into something with it. And then you get some headlight detail right underneath the fenders there. The binoculars, they act as eyes, I guess, so the vehicle can see where it's going, of course. And then you get a green, uh, green stud right here, which I guess maybe you can say is a motion sensor, or a distance sensor, or night vision. It's a sensor, and it senses things. Up top is probably the most interesting bit. We'll do the rear end after this, which is, well, it's rather anticlimactic, the rear end. But while we're at the, uh, the topic of the gun here, you get a large ammo box right here. You get a sensor right there. You have another sensor right there. And the gun, it does go up and down a bit. And it also has a range of motion. Rather restricted, I think you could only go maybe 270 degrees, possibly. But it does move around so it can acquire and shoot at targets that are not directly ahead of it. Now, as I said, the rather anticlimactic rear end of it. Just a couple walkie-talkies on the back here that are clipped on, so you get some aerial antennas. And then it just has vents. You know, vents and taillights. Because those are really important on a vehicle like this. I don't know if they actually are, but, you know, it's, it's a fun detail and I might as well add it. But anyhow, that has been my Z-01 UGV. I actually have a breakdown of this on my Flickr page, which I'll link in the description below. But I hope you enjoyed it, and if you do decide to build it, tell me about it. I'd love to see what your take on the, uh, on the little, little buddy here is. But anyhow, hope you enjoyed this video, and like, comment, and maybe subscribe to the channel if you want to. But until next time, we'll catch you later. Bye.